Hi everyone, welcome to the Daily Message. This is your daily reading for tomorrow, uh, Thursday, September the 3rd, 2020. For all signs, all signs that may be watching. Uh, for your reading today, I'm going to be pulling some oracle messages from the Butterfly Oracle Cards for Life Changes. No tarot messages uh, for tomorrow. And I um, just want to see what, what comes out, what wants to come out. This is a reading for the collective, so it may not resonate with everyone. Um, as I always say, for the most accurate reading with the most accurate outcome, uh, you may go get a personal private tarot reading from either me or your favorite tarot reader out there. And as I mentioned, these are the Butterfly Oracle cards for life changes. So I want to see what is uh, coming out for people tomorrow. What is coming up for people tomorrow? What are the major themes, issues, uh, life changes, transitions people are going through right now? What do people need to focus on? Okay. We have gracefully aging. All right. So I could be speaking to, you know, uh, maybe an older population of people. I'm getting from anyone that's uh, 40 or older. So between the ages of 40 and, and 80 years old, 49 years old. Well, let's see. What else do we need to know? What other messages want to come through? And actually, I did see that at the bottom of the deck uh, before I even started shuffling. So I had a feeling that was going to come out. What else do we need to know about tomorrow? What other messages do you want to share with the collective? What do we need to be focusing on? Okay. We have spiritual growth. And we have self-care. Okay. So I think I'm going to stop there. At the bottom of the deck, we have courage. So I'm kind of seeing a group of people here who are uh, getting up there, okay? Um, I'm not seeing that this reading necessarily applies to, um, let me just put it in quotations, millennials, or um, this may apply more to like the baby boomer generation, um, maybe even uh, Generation Y, um, maybe some Generation Xers. Um, I would say pretty much uh, anyone born after... Um, Sorry, anyone born before like the 1980s, um, the late 70s, um, and before, I feel like this reading kind of applies to. So if you're like if you're really young, like if you're in your 20s, I would say maybe even early 30s, this may not apply to you. Um, so I'm seeing like a cohort here is what I'm seeing right now. Um, spiritual growth is coming up. Okay, so something that we need to focus on is. Um, as you know, we had a full moon in Pisces, or we just had a full moon in Pisces. We have it today. Um, and Pisces uh, is a uh, very spiritual, very spiritual sign. Um, represents all the karma, all the lessons and um, masterings of all the signs that come before it. So um, I also feel like, you know, with the South Node and Sagittarius and with Jupiter and Saturn, uh, especially Jupiter retrograde and Capricorn right now, there is um, there is an emphasis on spiritual growth right now for a lot of people. Um, and anyone that uh, is definitely aging or going through an aging process, um, I'm kind of getting hope and faith. And I'm not necessarily getting religion here. I'm getting how we progress as we age, what, um, what needs to happen for us in order to grow spiritually. And then all we have self-care coming up as well. As these are major issues that we are going to be focusing on that we need to focus on right now. Um, so how do we care for the individual? How do we care for ourselves on a daily basis? What things are we doing or are we incorporating in our routines? Okay. And I feel that doing these things is going to take courage. It's also part of that expansion process. Because I feel like it takes courage to, to age gracefully. It takes courage to grow spiritually. It takes courage to give yourself care when, especially, there are outside factors going on in your life. There's other circumstances. 
So I want to get into a little bit more of what these messages are about. So I'm just going to read through these here for you guys. So as you receive this card because heaven can see your inner and outer beauty and wants you to appreciate your divine magnificence too. This means that you allow yourself to see the beauty that growing older represents. The more you hold positive thoughts and feelings about the aging process, the more you glow with inner peace and sage wisdom. Your maturity signifies that you will be seen as an elder and others will look to you for an answers. For answers. This is an honor which is one reason why this card is guiding you to age gracefully, meaning that you embrace your hard-won years of learning. Although you may feel much younger than your chronological years, graceful aging means that you are comfortable with yourself in every way. Additional meanings, caring for aging parents or other elders, learning from an elder, a change in beauty care routines, or preparing for retirement. Okay. Now, all of these messages may resonate with you, or um, please take what resonates and leave the rest. We have spiritual growth here. Let's talk about what that means. This card signifies that the change you're currently in the midst of or contemplating is part of your spiritual growth. It will bring about great blessings, even if challenges present themselves along the way. As this experience comes to a conclusion, you'll know that you are very strong indeed. In fact, this situation will push you to leave behind your comfort zone. You'll reach deep inside to a reservoir of strength that you didn't know you had. This strength is both peaceful and powerful, and it helps you learn new life lessons as well as let go of old pain and forgive your past. Additional Meanings Spiritual seeking, a change of religion or new spiritual path, being true to yourself, a legal issue, a health challenge. Now let's talk about uh, self-care. It says, before a butterfly emerges with beautiful wings, it spends time in its cocoon. Similarly, this card is asking you to retreat for some much-needed rest and self-care. If you are breathing a sigh of relief upon reading this, that's another sign of the need for a healing pause. Self-care can take many forms, but the important thing is for you to look after yourself in a way that promotes your happiness, your health, and your high energy. This may involve a detox of your diet, or getting away from any harsh energy relationships or circumstances. Take great care of yourself and you will fly high and free like a butterfly. Additional meanings. Go on a retreat. Simplify your life. Assert yourself and learn to say no. And then at the bottom of the deck here we have this card, Courage. Your card reminds you that you do have the courage to make this change. Everything you've been through in life has taught you how to cope and be strong in the face of the unknown. You've learned that being positive and having faith are necessary tools to overcome fear or disappointments. Take this change one minute at a time and try not to look too far down the road, especially if attempting to predict the future brings up anxiety for you. After all, you can plan for the future, but you can only take charge of this present moment. So, take positive action steps today toward your desired outcome and know that you will have everything you need in each moment that follows. Everything. Additional meanings. Facing your fears. Stepping into a leadership position. Breaking out of your comfort zone. Assertiveness. Thank you for allowing me to share these messages with you today. If any of you would like to book a personal private tarot reading with me, my information is below in the description. I look forward to working with you and I send you blessings.